what up it's your boy king down 225 coming at you with another actionary video so hit that like subscribe become part of the kingdom y'all know i say my channel for my community my b1 community and with the gender war and the red pill and i know we always seem to always have a lot of infighting but i'm b1 all day and i just want to remind y'all where we stand is grand, where we stand as a community in this grand scheme of things to American society. Like, y'all like to tend to think because your friends with people that's uh, non B1 that we have past racism. It don't exist. Let's talk about other people's problems. Let's get involved with other people's issues. Or let's talk about the border wall, wall or the border wall. Let's talk about transgender, L LGBT. Oh, they got their own community and they fight for their community. So we need to focus on our, ours, okay? Like, it don't matter. So this goes to the divestor who think, oh, we can go and get better treatment by uh non b1 community males because these spooky and ray rays ain't shit so let's uh start on this video first okay all right i can't even work working wild black you stupid monkey fedex driver gets disrespected by racist homeowner threatens to show him how little black lives matter okay Let's get to the video. Douglasville, Georgia. I'm from Louisiana. Smell like a racist town. Stupid monkey. Come on, hey, say it again. Say it again. Say it again. Say it again. Get out, you fucking dumb nigga. I'm fucking what? Are you a dumb nigger? <laughs> what part? You want me to go to fuck around with a white man? You run over my dog, I'll show Ain't nobody running over nothing. Black lives matter. Hey, welcome to Facebook. You think I give a fuck, nigga? Hey, what's up, though? See, the old me and probably this new me, I whooped your ass. You know, we deliver your package. Just, we deliver your packages. We take out your garbage. We know, have a history of raising your goddamn children and still, still, no respect. No respect. We're nothing. We're trash. We're all the negative things. We're always the problem with America. Yeah, they suck up the the teeth of the black creation. Hmm. What can I do in this world as a black man that's working to provide for my family and deliver services for the country? Hmm. Call the police. That's what you say. Oh, coward cop. Woman gets repeatedly beat by police during her arrest after incident over missing cheese at McDonald's. That's right. This lady got beat for cheese. An Ohio woman made a complaint about the extra slice of cheese missing on her Big Mac. Things escalated to the point where one cop is seen on the video punching her multiple times. According to TMZ, the Tinker Hancock is the woman in the video police attempted to detain on Monday in Butler Township, Ohio. Ohio, right? Like, but they always accuse us of being racist and, and the North is void of racism. Yeah, you bring up Ohio is like, that's where the black people who was in the, the Underground Railroad ran to escape Ohio and Canada. Okay. Yes, y'all ain't racist, huh? Uh, the same money in Butler Town, Ohio. First you hear some argument, then one of the cops punches her seven times while people in the fast food establishment are trying to decipher what's happening. During an interview with TMZ Hancock's attorney, Michael Wright of Wright and Schultz said the incident began after Hancock purchased a Big Mac with extra cheese. When she received her burger, she claimed the extra cheese was missing. Employees called the police on her after things escalated quickly. She claimed she was confronted by Butler Township PD while she was trying to leave. 
White says her client had Chicago punched multiple times into the hospital where she was discovered she suffered a head injury. Okay, before I even play this video, like I used to work at a fast food restaurant when I was younger. Like, cheese costs less than a dollar. You mean to tell me you can't put no motherfucking cheese or make another burger for irate customer? I thought customers are already, always right. Instead of calling the goddamn police and wasting taxpayers' time, not that motherfucking dollar worth of cheese, less than a dollar worth of cheese, has ballooned to at least two, three thousand dollars for some goddamn cheese. McDonald's, y'all need to be ashamed of yourself. Let's get to this video now. There's a reason why I put these two videos together. Because YouTube be tripping about certain shit. Fucking cheese, y'all. She this cheese we talking about. This cheese. She ain't she ain't commit no robbery. She ain't shoot nobody. She ain't great nobody. She talk about cheese. She fucking paid for it that she didn't get. And this is what we this is what we hear. This is what why we hear. So a lot of y'all divest think life gonna be better. When y'all gonna learn? We all we got sometimes. For the most part, even our own. Skin tone, who not, who none FBA don't really fuck with us. So when we go unite and realize, like, until we work together, shit like this ain't gonna never stop. I implore you to look at your fellow black man differently, as opposed to how the media or the world told you you supposed to view them and look at them. Look at that condition, that circumstance, and fucking come up with solutions to make this these situations better for us. Instead of abandoning and turning our backs on each other and fucking critiquing and complaining all the fucking time. Hit that like, subscribe, become part of the kingdom.